Where do you want me to go? That's on our. No. That's... Mom, where the hell do you want me to go, you dumb bitch? I don't have to listen. I said, give me a minute, and you can't give me a minute. Parents love their kids more than anything in the world. However, what happens when their kids spiral out of control and they have to call law enforcement for help? Mom, stop it! Leave me alone! You ruined my life! She's asking. You're done. You, you, I'm 31. Back off! You let them know Why what your daughter has been doing. Because doing. you are threatening to kill it. Carmen, We're her kids, and Brandon. You ruined my life! I was about to leave to go home! Here are times when parents sent their spoiled kids to jail. Starting with the case of Laura, who got domestically violent with her own aged mother. No, but I have a case already going on. What type of case? A felony case because I got accused of something. I was in the kitchen. She threw my phone. She grabbed me, pulled my hair. Okay. You're making me go to jail again. You're ruining my life. Why am I being arrested? I didn't do anything. On December the 10th, 2023, Miami police responded to a domestic violence call involving a woman causing a disturbance at home. However, when the police arrived on the scene, they realized things weren't so black and white. The officers found the caller outside the house and Laura, the alleged suspect, inside. Initial questioning of Laura showed her as the victim. However, the officer started having suspicions after further investigation. Police is not a bad thing. No, but I have a case already going on. What type of case? A felony case because I got accused of something back in March and I told my what? What? um apparently cutting somebody with a knife. Okay. I had to not here, somewhere else. And I have a lawyer, and my lawyer told my mom to stop getting hospitals on the phone. Let Laura calm no, down. No, she, she told me to back off. Laura, you're gonna talk quietly. I can hear you. I'm staying here temporarily to be with my dog, and I was going about to go, about to go back home to my apartment. Yeah, I don't you live here. I have my own apartment. Mm -hmm. And my sister told her to stop getting the cops on the phone. She's trying to calm down. My sister was trying to calm me down. I'm, I'm pissed off. You still haven't answered my question. Why were you with, with Oh, bleach? I was in the bathroom. My, my sister was in the bathroom with me, and I had bleach in my hand already, and it spelt. It got spelt. Mom, stop it. Leave me alone. You ruined my life. She's asking. You're she's done. You're, you're, I'm 31. Back off. She's telling us about the help that you need. No, I've been in the hospital. I have a lawyer. My, my lawyer told her to stop calling. Let's let Laura go and do her own thing. She's been doing this since 2011. So what did you do with the bleach bottle? She said she was in the bathroom with the bleach. What did she do with my it? My sister even said to like leave her alone. Stop calling the cops. Okay. I, I, what made me mad is because my, everybody keeps saying... Yeah. Laura's mental instability started peeking through, and the mother's statements were a clear contradiction to what Laura was saying. She has been threatening to kill the ex-boyfriend. Okay, she, so 
I'm going to ask you a question. Do you think the Baker Act is going to help her moving forward? I think what would help her, and this is from experience, because her entire life she has had problems. Okay? When did she pull your hair? Uh, about 10 minutes ago, right as you were showing up here. I was in the kitchen, she threw my phone, she grabbed me, pulled my hair, okay, okay. tried to throw me off balance. I just had a stroke in September, my balance isn't that great to begin with, okay. you know. But in any event... And, and you were trying to help during this whole time too? Yeah, I pulled her off. You pulled her off, okay. But, but as I said, when she has proper help and they have the facts, then she can do much better. She also has ADD, which is an impulse control problem to begin with. Okay, she has some criminal charges now for reacting for reacting badly to bullies. Her name is. She misinterprets what people tell her. Yes. She is paranoid. She's making threats best. After getting the full story, the officer returned to Mora, but that is when her true colors started to shine. I'm not doing anything! No! Yeah, no, 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 you lied to me! Listen. I didn't do anything! Step by step, everything. Listen. She's going to talk to the state attorney's office. She's going to talk, no. to, the, she's gonna uh, talk to all you, the lawyers in the court. Are you okay trying to help her put it on? No! Yeah. no. She's gonna what? talk to the state attorney's office, okay? However, we have no discretion, you know, like your mom. But I'm not doing anything. Your mom and your mom's Laura. No, but I'm not. I didn't do anything. You're gonna put your feet in? You Natalie, why did you open the door? I didn't do anything. You're making me go to jail. We're gonna put in a car. Maybe we can put it. Is she going to jail? Uh, we'll talk to no, I didn't. No, you have no shorts on. You have shorts. You're making me go to jail again. You're ruining my love. You're ruining my love. I was about to leave to go home. Yeah, let's take her to the car and then we'll try to be. You're ruining my life. The lawyer told you to stop. I'm not doing anything to you. I wasn't doing anything to you. You punched me in the head. This my mom is ruining right? my life! Natalie, why did you do that? You Yes, you did! No, but you're taking me to jail! I didn't do anything to her! Natalie, put me in the fucking Natalie, what the hell? Are you gonna let me help you help me? Why am I didn't do anything to my mom? You gonna let me help you? Well, no, but I didn't do anything to my mom. Okay, so you're not gonna go on shorts? No, but why am I being arrested? I didn't do anything. Unfortunately for Laura, she crossed the line today and was subsequently arrested. However, her attitude showed no signs of improving. Oh, the guy punched, she punched me in the, domestic violence. She punched me in the head. Okay, let me, let me see your feet. No, why am I domestic violence? She's the one who punched me in the okay, head. So you don't want to no, but why? She's the one who punched. Okay. No, why? Okay, then you have to get in the car. No, but why? She. No, Natalie, why'd you tell the truth? You punched me in the head. Now, mom, mom said I'm domestic violence. You're the one who. Oh, I didn't. Oh, I pulled her hair because she covered it off me. Okay, you gotta get in the car. No. Of course, you. I'm pushing you hard. I don't want to. Okay, you gotta get in the car. Natalie, what the hell? She doesn't want to push charges on you. Then why are you having me arrested? I didn't do anything. I'm trying to have you arrested. She doesn't want to put on the shorts. She's not gonna. She can sit on the shorts. Put on the shorts. No, why am I being arrested? I didn't do anything. She didn't want to press charges. Then what is she doing? We're gonna explain to you. You have to put on your shorts. You gotta sit down. I don't please. I don't want to go to jail. I'm not doing anything. I didn't threaten anybody. Are you gonna put these shorts on? I'm not being here. No, but you're taking me to jail. No, I don't want to go to jail. You're She's running. done it before, but I'm gonna explain it to her. I explained her to the. You gonna put these on? So but I don't understand. I'm not doing backseat. anything. She's trying to make my life worse. What is she doing? No, what is she doing? Okay. 
But you're taking me to jail. Yes, ma'am. We have to do it. Whenever it's domestic, we have to I didn't do anything. She's the one who I didn't no, she punched me in the hand. Yeah. I didn't do anything. You're ruining my life. No, but no, we want you to tell the truth. Wait, wait, let me put on um, some, some gloves. I didn't do anything. You're ruining my case. I told you to tell mom to stop. I didn't do anything. I didn't do anything. Because this is, a, this is a family. We can change things, okay? This is a family issue right now. Please sit inside. Okay, put your feet inside. I, I don't really want to go in jail. Reason. This doesn't mean that you're going to jail at this moment. You are secu safely secured. You're not out in the open screaming out loud. You sit here quietly. Okay? Please put your feet in. Thank you so much. Okay? Please don't pardon me, though. We don't lie. Laura was then taken down to the station where she was charged with domestic battery. But that was nothing compared to Corey, who not only got in a screaming match with his mother, but fled from the scene too. Why are you crying right now? Just jumping like, I can't believe you would talk to me like that. And I'm your mother. Go now, go now, go now. Corey, why are you up? Calm down. Calm down. Oh, it's, it's the police. Corey, tell her. What? You will be put out. Talk to her. <laughs> On June the 3rd, 2023, an officer was called to a residence regarding a dispute between a mum and her son. A female officer arrived on the scene to first hear the victim out. How's it going? We got a few you calls. Mean? Okay. You here? Is this your partner? Mm -hmm. How's it going? No, it's not my partner. It's my, it's my son. Okay, that's your son. Yeah. You want to come on out and talk to me for a minute? Yeah, I can't come out. All right, thank you. 10 12, female house. What's going on? Family fight? Yes. Mystic crap. Piss me off. Yeah. It's like, you're like talking back and shit. Who's, who's talking back? My son. Is he drinking? Is he drugging? What's he no. doing? You just fighting, family fights. Just don't like when he calls me an age, and I was like, I will call. He said, oh, go ahead and call it, and I will. Okay. I just wanted to know that I'm not the prey. Okay. If I need help, I need help. Okay. But I think it'll be all right if you just call him down, like, I'm pissed. Does he live here with you? No. So what, are you going to ask him to leave? Mm-hmm. Okay. And who do you stay here with? Myself and my daughters. Who's the other two guys in here? One's oh, your that, son. Th then my, uh, my stepson. So your son and your stepson are mm -hmm. here? They're both my sons. Okay. Are you having trouble with both or just mm -hmm. one? Just the one. The one in the kitchen or the one sitting here? The one with the bed. Was it the one in the kitchen? Yeah. No, no, that's a big one. The, little. the one over here? Yeah. Okay. How old is he? 23. 23? Okay. I think it'll be all right. All right. Well, I just want to make sure you Yeah. Are you guys fighting, like touching each other, fighting no. on each other? Just yelling? This is my <laughs> Disrespect. And I wanted to know that I will call her. If I think that you're going to like say something to me like that, I will call her. Yeah, yeah. You're not going to even try to threaten me or do anything. I'm not putting up with it. Was he threatening you? I know. Yeah. You just fighting about something. I didn't know how far I was going to get. I just wanted his to know. To know. Okay. Like, this is the first call, the second time you're out of here. What's your, what's your last name, sweetheart? Nobody been drinking? Oh. Just disrespect. Just disrespect. Just disrespect. You know, I'm not talking to anyone. Okay, Corey, talk to me. Maybe. Okay. You feel safe here? Mm -hmm. You do? So mm -hmm. when I leave, if I come back here, then it's right. not going to be pretty. I know. You know? I know. Um, but he, no one put hands on you or anything? Why are you crying right now? Just jumping like, I can't believe you would talk to me like that. And I'm your mother. Your feelings are hurt? Is that what's going on? Real hurt. Like, I feel like when you talk like to your mother like that, you shorten your days. What did he say? It's just like everything. Like, I, Never would you take a million years to call my mother a bitch. I would be terrified. Just no respect. This is whole generation. It's like they're just worse and worse. The mother was clearly distressed because of how her son was treating her. This bad treatment only became more visible in the next few moments. All right, let me see if Corey will talk to me. Uh, Thank you. Open the door. Jermaine, open the door! Jermaine, open the door! My God! Jermaine, open the door! Open the door! Open the door! 
what they doing? You got a key? No, my key's inside. Open the door for they open it for you. Are you scared of me now? With all that lip. Would they fight each other? No. The boys? Mm -hmm. Come on, open the door for your mom. That's probably what they're thinking, but I don't want to come in. She said open it. She's not coming in. I need to go upstairs. Oh, my gosh. The house did not belong to the son, so he had no right to lock her out. After a painstaking wait, the door finally opened. They want me gone. They just need... Thank you. Thank you. Are you Corey? Where's Corey? No. Oh, it's all right. I'm not coming in your house. It's all right. Is Corey around? No, I'm going to go to work. You're trying to go to work? Oh. Everything going to be all right here? Families have fights. I get it. Families have disputes, you know? Corey, shut up! Shut the See how he is? Tell me. That's that pop is that. Do you want to go to jail? Corey. Corey. You kicking him out? He didn't put his hands on you? No. Okay. What's he mad about? I don't know. He's just looks all the time. All the time. He's always no, talking. Talk. That's the shit. Why are you walking? Come down. Come down. Come down. Come down. Corey, why are you up with that? Come down. 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 Come drum splitting screaming match ensued between the mother and her son with neither side willing to back down the officer then tried to engage Corey the suspect in a conversation Corey you going to work or anything today I'm just trying to get you away from mom full time I just paid my rent no I'm just trying to get you away from mom I just paid my rent why I got I just paid I didn't say I just paid ma'am I didn't say anything I just about paid that I'm trying to say, I'm trying to separate the two of you because no, you're both I, 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 don't, I, don't, I don't have to say anything. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't have to say nothing. I, I, I can pay. Pay. So I ain't going to get no money. I ain't going to get my money back. Because you know what? Hey, I'm sorry. I'll walk out of the building and get my money back. All right, Corey. Okay. You want to come lock your door? Yes, they going to get my money. Get my money. They going to be all right? Yeah, they going to be all right. You stay here too? Yeah, he good. He good. He's been drinking. 
Yeah, that's it. All he doing is man. He ain't doing nothing bad. He ain't doing nothing bad. Corey, you didn't put your hands on mama? All right, you just having a family fight? Is that what's going on? No, she never tell y'all put my hands on No, she didn't say that. She did not say that. All right. All right. I'm just making sure. I don't want you to put your hands on mama. Okay? I understand you two can be upset with each other. All right? If you you stay here with mom, I'm asking you. You live here? You pay rent here and everything? All right. If you can, mama's going to say, she says she's going upstairs. All right? If you can go hang at your friend's house for a little bit, enjoy your Saturday, turn up a little bit to your friends, you two need to separate for a minute. All right? I didn't say you got you can't come home tonight. No, I yeah, just said yeah, let her. Right, right, I, want, I want that. I want that. I need to get around. So okay, so right. if you can go to your friend's house for a minute, chill out the rest of the day. It's Saturday. You said you've been working. All right, chill it down. Okay, because we don't want to come back out here and get involved in your family. You know, families families are tough. All right, we don't want to get involved, but we just don't want you putting your hands on each other. Neighbors are calling, making a scene. You know, I get it. I fight with my family too. But we can't be doing it when neighbors are upset, you know, because yeah. they're going to call every time you're out here having a fight. Yeah, he ain't right? that wild. I mean, he just, he just been, yeah. that's it. See, right now you're being civil. Yeah. You know, you calm back down. You're being civil. No time to hurt. That's good. Mm -hmm. Let her do her thing. You go do your thing at your buddy's house, your partner's house, your girl's house, whatever. I'm telling him the same I told you. Oh, yeah. I'm about to kick Ross. I can't even be around this type of stuff. You know do you want to leave while I'm leaving? Or are you going to leave after I leave? I prefer you to leave while I'm leaving, just so I know you two are separate. I can't kick you out. I might, I might leave after you. You might leave after I leave. See, that, that's concerning because if I go get in the car, people will start fighting back up, you know. And then I'm back here again and I got to bring all my friends next time. That's my little brother. We just have Before I put my hand on my mouth, big brother going to be like, he's going to be jazzed. He's going to up. Just when it seems like the situation had de-escalated, Tori did something unexpected. Uh, uh, my spotted mouth running. Uh, 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 running on 36th Street. We won it. He's on 36th. The mother called again and reported Corey was being hostile with her, prompting officers to arrive on the scene. However, Corey jumped off his balcony and started running away, but was arrested soon enough. He was eventually charged with resisting arrest. But the next case only showed how much of a toddler grown-ups could act like. Don't touch me like that. Don't do it. Stand up. On September the 2nd, 2023, officers responded to a report of a verbal domestic disturbance at a residence. When they arrived on the scene, they were shocked to find the suspect more hostile than they expected. Please, from me. Don't knock so hard. Sorry. Relax. Okay, what's going on? You tell me. Did I call for me for a verbal domestic? And? What's going on, Trudy? You tell me. I just told you what's You got the verbal domestic, I did. Who called you? Did you call? No. Where's your mom at? Mom! Can you talk to one of us outside? Mm -hmm. Mom! Go talk to them! No, you go talk to them. You go outside and talk to them. Don't have to go outside. Talk to he them. said go outside no, and talk to them. Can you talk to him outside? 
No, I'm not going to talk to anybody. No, I'm not going to talk to any of you. You don't want to talk to us? No, why? I'm trying to figure out what happened. For what? To investigate. I don't care about you guys. You guys don't matter anymore. Okay. What do you want? What do you want? What do you want? What? We just called over here for a verbal This way, this way. Go ahead. We don't know what's we don't know what's going on. We're just here to figure out. To my understanding, you and your mom were having a verbal argument. I didn't know it was that bad. I don't know. I'm trying to figure out. You've been DC out tonight or no? No, no. No. I'm I'm just upset. Well, my son plays in a band and he's been fighting with his wife on the phone, texting back and forth and accusing her of stuff and I guess she must have told him the stuff that she was accusing her of. Why did of cheating on him your face and okay? Huh? So you wanna is your see face it? okay? My face okay. It looks a little red. Oh, well, probably just upset. Okay. Yeah, did she hit you at all? No, she kind of pushed me, but now my son is all upset. You know? Has she been drinking all? I'm sorry. Oh, she drinks all the weekend. Yeah, has she been drinking tonight? No, well, she probably has. I can't. I don't know, but she had because she hides her liquor, you know. But I assume she's been drinking. Liquor. She has a drinking problem, a severe drinking problem. I mean, she'll drink like four. I'll find like four pints of empty pints of vodka in, you know, before she hides them. You know, I mean, it's out of control. Her drinking. Okay. And we've had to call the police in the past. She uh, at one time did pinch me, and I had bruises. You know, my shoe. That was sometimes I had me because I said. Like I said, this is not the first While one officer heard the caller's side of the story, another heard the suspect out. Your mom had to have been pretty scared, though, to probably call us, right, or no? No. So why do you think she called us? Because that's just my mom. Honestly, my mom is just a little bit drama. She drama. You're drama. We're all drama. Everyone's drama. Yes. How do we fix it? How do we make it better? Yeah. Do you want to take off for the night? Do you want to get a car or no? You drive? No, no more. No. Yeah, and I hate you, by the way. You hate me? Yeah. I remember who you are. What did I do? I remember what you did to me. What did I do to you? A lot of stuff. One time I dealt with you is whenever you guys were fighting. That's the time I dealt with you. Yeah. It's, a, it's okay. I never harmed you or hurt you. No, you never harmed me or hurt me. I treated you wrong. <laughs> My husband gets away with a lot more than no. that night, I ever did. That night, you guys all got charged with the same thing. All of you guys. What was that? Just put me in jail. What are you doing? Everything my mom said. Just put me in jail. Jail, please, please. Life's too expensive. Go. Just put me in jail. I've already been there. Let me go. Your mom's claiming that you pushed her, okay? I don't care what my mom says. What? Do you know she pushed me too? You guys don't know what she does. You can't push your mom. I'm okay. I'm... No, I don't think you're a bad person, but you can't push your mom, okay? And she can push me? She said she did in self defense after you pushed her. Are you kidding me? Whenever I first asked you physical, you said no physical. It and was when, not when I physical. Asked, when I asked her first, she because said, I'm not going to rat out my mom. I didn't touch my mom. I need you to stand up for me. Huh? I need you to stand up for me. I can't. Why not? Because I don't know what you're up to. And I don't want to be about anything. I'm going to tell you to turn around. No, I'm not. Back. No. I don't want to put my hands behind my back. I didn't do anything wrong. She's saying you pushed her. I didn't. Come on, Trudy, stand up. I did not push my mom. Trudy, can you please stand I up? I didn't. Trudy. Are you kidding me? Can you please stand up? I guess I should push some shoes on since you want to be an a You're always the a And you better make sure they take care of me this time when they go to jail. Well, yeah, what medical conditions do you have? I'm f sick, dude. I'm just asking, is there anything diagnosed? From the two narratives the officers get, they determine that the daughter is the aggressor and so make the decision of arresting her. However, although she seemed understanding at the start, she became more unstable once she reached her bedroom. What the f is wrong with you? Can, can you go in there, please? Can you go in there, close her, No, please? she's going to come in here and you can go in there, be in here too. You can be in here too. You gonna, can be in here too. Not do not I'm not. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna put up with this. Shit, mom, I don't care how much she hates me. It's not up to me. It's the law. Say statue. I'm not. But listen, 
Your mom. Your mom. It's a domestic relationship. Battery and house member. Your mom told me she pushed you. I never but touched her. I never touched her. I'll be on her to testify to it in court. Give it. Give it. What do you mean? Prove it. Her statement is enough. No, yes, I is. never touched her. Put your shoe on Trish. I never touched my mom. Can you please put your shoe on Trish? Tell her to come over here and say it in front of Are you, me. That's not how it works. Yes, that why? Trudy, that's not how it works. Why? Because that's not how the law why works. Why can't she say that in front of you? You can face your accuser in court. Why? Why can't she say it in front of me? I'm just doing my job. Okay, well do your job and have her come over that's here and say that in front of me. I didn't do nothing and I'm not going to spend another night in court. Come on Trudy. No. Let's go. Stand up for me, please. Why are you doing this? Trudy, stand up for me. Ah! Trudy, stand up. I don't want to have to force you up. You've always been calm. Just stand up. Is there another option? Okay. Why? Because it's a domestic Trudy. I didn't do nothing to her. That'll, have to, that'll be in court. Well, let it be in court. It doesn't have to be right now. Yes, it does. No, it doesn't. Yes, it does. No, it doesn't. Stay stacked. I didn't touch her. That's all she said. And then you, had, you admitted to pushing her after she pushed you. I asked you, did you... Oh, did you put something on her, huh? then? What do you mean? No. When I first walked in there, I said, was it physical at all? She said, she pushed me. I said, did she and? hit you or push you? And? That's, yeah, that's a battery. And her touching me first isn't nothing. She said that you touched her first first. I didn't touch her okay, first. Okay, the officer gave the woman multiple chances to surrender voluntarily, but she continued denying the allegations. Finally, the officers had to resort to this. We've been patient with you enough, Trudy. Now I don't up. care. This is a lie. You guys don't have to Trudy. deal with this. Don't touch me unlawfully. Do not. I you're said don't touch getting, me. You're already going to get charges. More charges, Trudy. Oh, look what you did, Mom. You guys are I swear. They don't listen. I don't have to listen. Yes, I do. said, give me a minute, and you can't give me a minute. Don't be like that. Don't do it! Don't. Stand up. You didn't even hit hard, Trudy. Come on. You're going to jail no matter what. You want, you want to get another pair? No. Can I get up on the bed? One, two, three. What's up, Trudy? Cut it out, Trudy. Stop. Get up. Come on, Trudy. I don't know how much you've been drinking. Trudy, stand up. Get up, Trudy. Passed out. Get her up on One, two, three. <laughs> Fainting, she's breathing. Does she usually pass out like this? Sometimes she does when she's drinking. When she's drinking? She is breathing. She is breathing. I suspect she's drinking. Also, I she's detained. I haven't seen it, but she fights her with her. Did I make it that hard for you? Huh? Now you could stand up, Trudy. Come on, stop playing around. I was hoping it wouldn't come to this, but... Is that because of you, Mom? Trudy, come on, stand up. Stand up, Trudy. Come Enough on. games. Enough of this. No, I can't. Now you're faking. I'm not faking. Okay, I'm up. sick, you f***ards. What are you sick with? You already picked up more charges. You're just fighting us and then all of a sudden Resisting you win. Uh, thanks thanks, you thanks, you thanks to me. my mom. Thanks to my mom. Resisting and you hit me. Thanks it's to my mom. I did not hit you. Yep. No, I did not hit you. Do not lie. Oh, we gave you a chance. Do not lie. Come on, Trudy, get up. I never hit you. Let's go, Trudy. Come on. In a dramatic turn of events, the suspect pretended to faint after hitting the wall, but then got back up as well. Then she got even more verbally abusive. I can't! Dumb then you'll go on the stretcher. No, I can't. I can go on a stretcher when I get to the jail. What the f are they going to do? Lay me on the floor? Dumbass. It's the doctor if you made a No, there's no doctor over there. No, 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 no. Yep. I've already gone through this bullshit. What? Do you have any pain right now? Yes, I have a lot of pain. I'm always in 
fucking pain. Bruh. Everywhere. They're not gonna do shit. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not going with those. If I have to wait for them to freaking get, oh, we need doctor's approval, and it's not gonna get approved for 20 days. Sorry, I'm not gonna do that. I have to function. This is not work for you. I'm. You're under arrest. Uh, no, I am not under arrest. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. No, I am not. I'm not asking you, I'm telling you. Uh, no, you're not telling me. I am not under arrest. I need medical attention they're right and they're not gonna give it to me. I already know, I've already been through this. They're not gonna give it to me. I've already gone through this, dude. Tell them to leave. What's up? Good morning. She said she was in pain everywhere. No, and get the f out of here. You guys leave. No, that's yes, not happening. Yes, 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 it is gonna happen. You want yes, to go it hospital? is gonna happen. You want to go to hospital? I will go to the hospital. Let's go. I'm talking to this police officer right now, so leave. Me? You want me? No, I don't want you. See you later. Okay, bye. You guys got that? Yes, got they do. Yes, they do. See it's you later. their problem. Bye. Let's go see But can you at least loosen me? Well, you just chill out? If you're cool with us, we're cool with you. Chill. You're not cool with me. Stand up and I'll loosen the cuffs for you. Hey. Okay. Stand up and I'll loosen them for you. Cuffs keys right here. I'll loosen the handcuffs for you. Okay? And can I at least put my hair in a ponytail? I look like a freaking mess. Not after you resist. Don't tell my mom. Not after you resisted us. Yes, I will resist you. Despite the clear politeness displayed by the officers, the suspect denied not only their consideration, but medical help as well. Regardless, the officers had a duty to take her down to the hospital. She said yes. Stop. Truly stop. Don't you f up. My mom said yes. Truly stop. Truly stop. Stop. I'm not. What the f is wrong with you? Let's go, Trudy. Let's go, Trudy. You're the biggest b I've ever met. Two fingers in here. Nope, nope, those are not. Two fingers. Nope, nope. Ben, stop, her. stop being so tense, Trudy. Nope. Let yes, that f shit loose. Stop. I'm going to I hate you guys I'll already. Two fingers. Let's go, Trudy. No, no. no. Let it go again. Oh, no, Trudy. Come on, Trudy. I hate you guys. Okay. Hate you. Okay. Lock cam. Huh? Hey, Mr. Cam. My mom touched me first. Okay, come on. Did you did you arrest my mom? With what? Because With what? I'm crippled, duh. I told you I was. Okay, do it yourself then, since I'm with a mess. You in the car? I asked you for help. You don't want to if call not, me? Stemon can come call me and a help dumbass. me. I don't give a f Get in the car. I asked you to f help me because I can't get in. Get in the car. You're the one calling me a dumbass. And? You are a dumbass. Okay, can you get him yourself? Well, fortunately. I can't! I need help, dumbass! Get in the car. I said I need help. What do you need help with? How do you help with? Can I lift you up and sit you in there? Yeah. You sat in there for the find the first time? No, I didn't. I asked for your <laughs> Don't you push me! I just did. Don't! Get in. What the f is wrong get with in. you? Don't you push me! Get in. I'm gonna force you in the set. After being cleared from the hospital, the suspect was finally taken down to the station. Because of this dumbass? Yes, you're coming. Because of this dumbass? One way or another. 
The suspect was charged with battery against a household member, resisting, evading or obstructing an officer and battery upon a police officer. Some criminals really took it to the next level, like Ethan, who put his hands on his own mother. I was standing right here. Yep. And this, he went did this he, way and then back. And did this. he push you up against the wall here? No, he just pushed me this way. Okay. Do no, not. Do not. I was, do it, this, I was explaining you're, it to him. You're, you're under arrest. You're under arrest. We'll talk about it. Any more? Any more? It's going to be resisting arrest. Just, just relax, I was explaining please. it. Yeah, thank you for another charge. I'm mean, in court already. Now it's going to be under my goddamn charge. Now I'm Because you grabbed your mom by the throat. It's because you will near my chin. I'm trying to protect myself. In July of 2023, officers were dispatched to a residence in Vermont after they received a call reporting a domestic violence situation. When an officer arrived on the scene, he first met the male suspect. What's going on? Drama. What's that? Drama. Drama? Can I try that in my eyes, please? I'm going to keep it on you so I know what you're doing. What do you know? I get that on me. All right, thank you. Appreciate that. Goes a long way. I'm no. Deputy Griffin, the Mulcahy Sheriff's Office. Oh, yeah. Got a call about... Some disturbance yeah. going on? Yeah, yeah. And what was your name? Ethan. I'm Ethan. the one that's supposed to be going on. Okay, so can I get your side of the story, Ethan? Yeah, might as well first. So basically, showed up here. My mom was arguing with me, saying, I just fucking kick the crack out and threw all right there. Yeah. And then she wiped that shit on me. And, yep. and we were a pit bull in here, and, her, and the dog bit her right here. Okay. And she blamed me for it. And okay. It just got worse and worse from that. Okay. So, so, so what happened when so you. So basically, everyone was saying I'm in a dangerous because I'm pissed off, but yes. Okay. So, we'll, did it? So, yeah, I'll, if you could stay inside, I'll talk to you in a little bit, okay? Yeah. Sound good? Thank you. I need to get my girls up. Well, they're gonna know everything, just so you know. All right, just if you just wait inside, that'd be great. I'm Thanks. To wait inside. Yeah. So, Ethan. So, you said things got out of hand. What does that mean? Things got out of hand. Okay. Like, so basically, she's saying I'm in a danger. Basically, okay. I didn't punch no holes in well enough. Okay. And she's telling, and she's telling me to leave. Like, I'm paying more than half the rent. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to have you sit in the back of my cruiser. I'm not going to sit in there. I'm not being detained. So I'm. Gonna well, you are being you are being detained until I know what's going on. You understand? Not, you're not under arrest. I'm not being detained because I'm not. Well, right now you're being under detained. I'll wait right here. Okay. Well, I don't know if you're going to wait right here. I will. Because what if I on go? My, on my word, I'll wait right here. Because okay. I know I didn't do nothing wrong. I ain't going to take off. I wouldn't wait here for you guys to show up if I did something bad. Okay, you're not going to take off or nothing? Nope, I won't. Okay, I just want to make sure there's no weapons in your car before I leave you out here by yourself. Do that makes sense? six in my room now. Okay. There's no ammo for it. But. Okay, well, I appreciate you telling me that. Yeah. You've been up front with me. I have. You know, I've been up front with you. There's no reason to All right. Be, so. so can you just show me your car so I just know there's no guns in here? Well, I know because I walked around the police here. You're not really supposed to look at my car on some being thing. Okay. But yeah, I can look. Well, if you outside. want, I can put you in handcuffs and put you in the back of my cruiser, okay? There's no reason to. Well, I can if you, if you want me to, no. while I'm waiting to I'm figure out what's that, going man. on. Okay. Look at my car. Sure all right. Place. Just want to make sure you don't have any guns or anything. All right. All right. Does that make sense? Care. Yeah. Can you roll down this. You can look right here if you want. Okay.
The male suspect, identified as Ethan, seemed relatively civil and was behaving with the officer. But as soon as the officer heard what the victim, his mother, had to say, he was shocked. Hello, ma'am. It's okay if I come in? Yeah. Uh, just so you know, my, my no, body... I want to talk to you. No, it's fine. Just wait till you... No, you're just... Go with the girls, go with the girls, let me talk to them, okay? Just yeah. calm down. Just want to make sure that the um, dog... Get her changed. Yeah, go with her, see her change. Yeah. Yeah. Cool, I'm not ready Just want to make sure the dog's locked up. No, he's in my room. He's and fine. I, he's fine. I understood you got bit by the dog? Yeah. Are you uh, okay? Do you need any? No, I'm fine. Um, do you need any EMS no, or anything? No, 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 okay. no. I'm, I'm, I'm good. I'm good. Okay, I'm good. I just want to make sure good. you're okay. No, I'm good. All right. No. Nope. Can you get her changed? She's soaking wet from hiding in the grass over there. Just get her changed, please. Yeah. Okay. So I have another officer with him That's right fine. now. Yeah. So I didn't want... want to do this. Okay. Like I'm so protected. Well, I, I have no idea what like... what's going on exactly. So okay. If so we could start at the beginning. He came home. Yeah. From oh, work. Okay. Oh, just go in my go in my girls' room. Go in my room with them. Just close the door. It's a good place to talk. And just so you know, my body cam's on. That's fine. Just, no, I, I wasn't sure if you heard me the first <laughs> yeah, time. No. Okay. Yeah. Um, okay, so he come home, and I had one of the uh, people from, they're picking up the salvage or, or the garbage yep. tomorrow morning, yep. so I asked him if he could help me drag the bags and stuff out to yep. the road. He refused. Okay. And so me and the girls went out, and we dragged them all out, whatever. So I okay. come back, and of course, my hands are soaking wet. So I go up, yep. and I, I wiped his arm with it. Yep. And he goes, he comes out to me like that, and that's when my dog. He comes which, at you like this? Yeah. So, like, is he uh, holding something? No, 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 okay. no, no. Just like, yep. you know what I'm trying to yep. say? Pissed off that I rubbed water yeah. on his arm. And so, of course, my dog's gonna. He doesn't like. He doesn't like drawing. He's like yep. any fighting, nothing like that. So my dog jumped, oh, yep. and he just happened to get my arm. Okay. Ethan laughs. Yep. And he thinks it's funny laughing. Yep. I'm like gushing blood out. Yeah. Whatever. He thinks it's hilarious. Go in there. Who is Virginia? She's in there, my room. No, she's not. Yes, she is. Just go in my room. She needs to get changed. Think it is funny. I told him to stop. Yep. I said, if you're gonna act like this, just go. I'm the only one on the lease with my girls. Yep. I had him move in because he had no place to go. Okay. And he just kept laughing and antagonizing, whatever. Yep. So he gets in my face and I yep. go like this. And I was like, stop, just f***ing stop. So I slapped him like that. He grabbed me, it still hurts, but he grabbed me right here, right yep. there, and he dragged me into the kitchen okay. like this by my throat. Okay. And I said, that's it, like, enough. Yep. I can't believe which, I, and it, I'm going to cut you up just a little bit. Which hand was he using to do that? I don't know. That's fine. And that's fine if you don't know. I don't know, but yeah, I don't this expect... right here is what hurts. Yep. It went underneath my esophagus. That's like when I swallow, it hurts. I don't, the girl said it's not swollen right now, so I don't know. Okay. And what? But right here is where it hurts, like underneath my esophagus. And this was all today? No, this was literally right before I called you. Okay. Okay, if I get a picture of that real quick. There's nothing there, is there? I didn't even look, but... I just like to get pictures, make sure, in case I... But up here, up. like, underneath here is where it hurts. Okay. Um, so and I said, that's it. I said, you put your hands on me. I don't know, what's your issue? Yeah. I said, but you need to go. Yeah. Right, and here, I'm still bleeding. I'm trying... I had to dump out my whole work bag trying to find, okay. you know, stuff to fix myself up. Yeah. He used to laugh and antagonize me. Ethan's initial persona of appearing chill all came down to a facade once the horrible details of his abuse came to light. The mother, identified as Abigail, then continued with the story. So then his girl, he starts yelling at his girlfriend. Mm -hmm. So she's sitting here and I told them, I said, just go in my room, separate yourself. Yeah, and because, that was the one I just met. Yeah, just, yeah. I told the girls to go in there. He wouldn't stop. Yeah. He smashed her phone on the floor. Okay. And then he comes in and smashes a six-year-old's, see that right there? That's a brand new bed. He just smashed it. Okay. Like the top and everything. Yep, he I smashed see that. It right yeah. there. And I said, that's it. Yep. I went in my room, locked the door, and I opened the window and had the girls go. Yep. Out the window. Thinking that the girls were in my rig, I figured he would follow me and I could go back to my boyfriend's in Brownington who'd follow me. Ethan okay. drives up next to me and realizes he's shining a light in my windows, realizes the girls ain't there. He pulls a Yui and heads right back, so of course I'm gonna come back. Mm -hmm. When I got back, my boyfriend's on the phone the whole time, he's still on the phone now. Yep. Heard the whole entire thing. And, are you okay? Is your shirt wet? Well, I guess you're in the grass. Hopefully you aren't poisoned. I'll have to give you a bath later. Um, so still your, begging your boyfriend to... is home? He's home at his house. Oh, at his house, okay. Yeah. He wasn't where we here. Were, no, where we yep. were gonna all go. He was on the phone the yep. whole time. We okay. were talking when this whole thing went yep. down. Um, so anyways, I gave I keep telling him, just go, just go. Like, yep. I don't want to do this, I don't want to do this. I've never done this before, I still don't want to do it. Yep. He wouldn't stop. Okay. So. And that's when you made the call? Yes. Okay. And could you just show me where he had put his hand on your throat? Right here. This is, I was standing right here. Yep. And this, and he went this he, way and then 
back and like did this. he push you up against the wall here no he just pushed me this way okay and he pushed you here and what yeah, happened don't... when you were in here nothing i mean obviously you see the blood from yeah the from the dog yeah. as well yeah, yeah. That's okay it. and his girlfriend was here for everything oh. that happened yeah. But she took the girls, the younger girls, and went out the window, like I told them, yep. and they were hiding, so. Okay. That's my 12-year-old, she was what she had to. Okay. And I he... just wanted, he just needed to go and just like, calm down. Yep. Reach it. Okay. I never understand had, that. I have seven kids, I've never had to do that before. Yep. Yeah. This is in the mouth. You can't have this in the mouth. And what's his girlfriend's name? Uh, legally, it's Lillian, and Lillian. she goes by Sky. By Sky. Okay. Yeah. Is she right over here? Okay, if I talk to her for a little bit. After getting the mother's side of the incident, the officer then went to talk to the suspect's girlfriend, Skye. I'm hoping you could tell me more about the part of the argument that got physical in this room. Um, Were you here for that? Uh, yeah, I was I was in here. I can give you everything from the beginning. I wasn't really a part of it. Okay. I, basically, he got home. He was in a sh mood. My phone hasn't been working. He gets yep. he overthinks and he gets... Uh, I don't want to say over things. He, he worries when I'm not able to answer him. Yep. I wasn't able to answer him most of the day. I came home, my phone magically started working fine, and everything was okay. Yeah. He he was seemed off. He seemed pretty pissed off, um, and didn't, he didn't seem to talk to me or do anything. I came out here to warm up food. Um, he, he one of the night he locked the door on me. He seemed pissed at me. Yep. I kind of just put the food down, let him warm it up later whenever he's hungry. Just let it be. Sat down here. He opened the door. Your time to say like. Say them to me like that wasn't really relevant to anything that happened. And this was all today. Yes. Okay. And um, his mom asked his mom had asked him to take out garbage because yep. for the female they're taking up everything at the corner. Yep. He he didn't want to. He went out there with a heavy bag and then just yep. left it there on the side of the road for her to dry the rest of the way. All right. She came in with yep. on her hand like nasty yep. like yep. gross stuff on her hand was joking around like trying to rub it on him. Yep. He took that as he was trying to like she was trying to hurt him. Yep. I guess. And he started like yelling, which got the dog pretty pissed off. The yep. dog jumped up. I wasn't really here for, I, I mean, I was here, but I was not paying attention enough mm -hmm. to really know what happened last night, other than he, there was yelling, they were arguing back and forth. He smashed my phone. Mm -hmm. um, were you here when he smashed your phone? Yeah, uh, he thought I was taking his mom's side. I'm not taking his side. I just can't be a part of aggression or yep. drama. Well, I just found out a couple, uh, like a couple days ago, that I'm pregnant with this kid. And okay. I'm stressed out as it is. So. Okay. Yeah, that sounds like a lot. Um. Yeah. Um. Especially when I'm only 17. I'm yep. turning 18 in a few days. But um. And then I just left everything alone, and then when the girls started jumping out the window, I went yep. with them, obviously, because she's five and can't yep. run in the roads alone, but they felt unsafe, yep. or they just didn't want to be a part of it, and they didn't want to be a witness to anything. So I went with them, carried them up the road. Again, not really sure what was going on here, what yep. was happening, if it was aggressive, or if it was just property destruction, or it was just back and forth yelling. Okay, and what did you hear exactly? Nothing, really. I just, yep. uh, Gia started crying, like, obviously mm -hmm. she's five, and, like, yelling just, just yelling, heard is, yelling is enough okay. for her to be scared yep. and not want to be here so they left and i went up the road to okay. one of the houses and just sat there in the yep. dark with them because he was going up and down the roads and like i said i okay. wasn't sure what was happening yep. i just kept them safe and yep. out of the drama and we we knocked into the door and asked them if we could use their phone okay i okay. said come down here and the cops are here yep and any spots in between or after i'm not part of and okay. can't speak for all right well i thank you so much for speaking with me sky um is there any way I could see him before he leaves just to give him a hug. Like, we don't even have to talk. I just want to give him a hug if he's okay with it. Um, it's alright. Uh, you think? Yeah. As more women spoke up, it became clear just how unstable Ethan was, and it was surprising how Skye wanted to hug him despite what he had done. This behavior of coddling him further became prominent with his mother's following statements. Or it could be that you want to have him charged no. for what happened tonight. I just, I don't want him back here tonight. Okay. He needs to cool down, he needs to okay. have time to think, and then we'll we'll talk about it later. Okay. I'm but, a single mom with a lot of kids, and the last thing I want is for one of them to be in jail. Like, but at the same time, at like, the, he has to learn that this is not acceptable. Exactly. But I also haven't seen him. And like, at the same time, it's not going to do him a lot of good if the next time I come up here, someone's really hurt. I want to leave tonight on your terms. You know what I mean? And I don't want to pressure you one way or the other. I called you because I couldn't get him out of the house. Okay. I couldn't calm him down in yeah. ways I and, can. And that's what, tonight, it I couldn't. that's what it sounded like to me as well. And he's completely not there. Yeah. Black eyes, couldn't. I could not get through to him. Okay. Um, I tried leaving. 
Um, he followed me. Luckily, the girls were still hiding, so I figured he would follow me. Okay. Um, someone's gonna get hurt, like really seriously hurt. Yes, he did hurt me, but I can get over it. It's, it is what it is. Type it's of thing. not. It's not what it is. He, you know. It's. You know, the dog. He said he was sworn to kill the dog. The dog was trying to protect me. He ended up biting me instead. That's why I have the dog here. The officer then went to break the news of the arrest to Ethan, but he wasn't too happy to hear that. All right, Ethan. Yeah. So I'm gonna be placing you under arrest, okay? For what? For domestic assault. How am I doing a domestic assault? So I'm gonna need you to come with me, okay? Is there a reason why first? Can I know? Yep. Because you put your hands on her throat. It's because she punched me in my chin. I told. I even explained okay. it to him. Oh, well, so him nope. Out? Can you get back inside? I was explaining it to him. I just. Hey, do no, not, do not. not. I was, do this, I was explaining you're, it listen, to him. You're, you're under arrest. You're Let's, under arrest. We'll talk about Any more? Any more? It's going to be yeah, interesting yeah, arrest. Yeah, I was explaining it. He's on vacation. Just, just, Put just your hands relax. behind your back. Just relax. Do it no. now. Oh my Please God. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Go back inside. Please. Go back inside. Just relax. Just relax. Yeah, thank you for another charge. I'm even in court. Already! Now it's gonna be under my goddamn charge now I'm f <laughs> No. I didn't charge you with anything. I'm not charging you. Why are they arresting me? There's no goddamn I took the for I took the decision out of he her hands. It's not her decision. Oh, so Ethan. Oh. Ethan. Ethan. Yeah, well, damn. you didn't really give me a decision here. Just relax. I could have got away if I wanted to, but I'm not going to. Well, that's good. I'm really glad you're not going to. I'm glad you didn't. I'm glad you did. Stop running your mouth. Abigail, Stop. can you go back inside for me? It's all right. We're going to treat him with respect, okay? <laughs> we'll talk about everything, I promise, all right? Just, just relax. I'll get on you. Ethan, I didn't do anything. He took it out of my hands because I cut it. All right, so you're going to need to drop this. I couldn't. We'll put it in your pocket so I have it. I'm going to need it, bud. I'm going to put it in your car. <laughs> you're not going to need it. All right. I love you. If you love me, just, you wouldn't do it. I didn't do it. She didn't do anything. I didn't she didn't do anything. I didn't do. She punched me in my chin. I understand that. And I pushed her back. And I'm getting it. Before we get him in, we're gonna need to check you for weapons. You see Do you have anything on? There's up, bud. No, I already checked them for proper fit. This one is tight. That one's really tight. Yes, it's hurting me bad. Like it's twisted around my. No, I can I can see that I have proper fit there. And still block, so, so goddamn much. Probably because keep pulling. So how long am I being here for? Until I talk to the judge. You already should be something there. So. Oh, sounds good. Anything in this front pocket? I don't have nothing, bud. Alright. Sounds good. Hop on up. Oh! Can I give my girlfriend a kiss? Nope. Ethan, come on, man. Go I'm ahead. I'm already. I'm already. I'm already. I'm already. I'm already. How am I getting charged with assault, dude? It was so, I pushed your back with my goddamn hands! Okay. Cool. 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 This was when Ethan's true colors started showing as he displayed hostility towards the officers he was being buddies with not too long ago. After being taken down to the station, the situation was further explained to him. All right, Ethan. So the judge ended up posting a $200 bail for you. Do you think anyone's going to be able to come get you for that? They also gave you conditions of release, so the, I'll read them all to you. So you, any violation of these would be considered a crime. You must not have contact with Abigail Langmaid, which includes in person, in writing, by telephone, by email, or through a third person, regardless of whether you are in jail or released. You must not abuse or harass in any way Abigail Langmaid, regardless of whether you are in jail or released. Like, how am I getting charged with assault? I was self-defense. You punched me right in my chin and I pushed your back by your neck. All right. So, how am I getting? Why is this happening? Because you grabbed your mom by the throat. It's because you wailed me in my chin. I'm trying to protect myself. Then you, it wasn't what it sounded like. The suspect was charged with domestic assault and resisting arrest. Santiago tried scaring his own mother outside her house, but got humbled quickly when the officers tased him. Get on the ground! 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 Get on the ground
On March the 3rd, 2024, officers with the Midland, Texas Police Department received a call reporting a male named Santiago who was outside of his mother's home scaring her. Officers were not prepared for just how much of a maniac Santiago was going to be. What's going on, man? Was there a fire here? Huh? What's that? No, I said, was there a fire here? In the back? Okay. The fire department already cleared and everything? Okay. You live here? Huh? You live here? Yeah, Whose house is this? Uh, I ring yeah, I got you. What's your name, man? You got any weapons on you? No, I don't All right, go ahead, turn around for me. Hey, what they say last Turn around for me, bro. You're gonna get tased. You're gonna get tased. Get on the ground. 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 You can get it again. Give me your Give me your hands. The situation went from 0 to 100 really quickly as Santiago ignored cop orders and was subsequently tased for about 50 seconds in total. Thankfully, they were able to subdue him to an extent. Put your hands behind your back. Go my hands. Grab your hands. Go. I'm about to break your finger. Get us out. Stop. Stop. They tried to stop. Get him. Mom, put your back. Chill. Shut up! Shut the f up! No, this one again. Don't ever try to f kick me again. And I try to take away the taser. Man, we're here for something else, man. What are you for? 13, 13. We got one in custody. We still need units out here. Mom! You okay? You good? I'm not coming back no more. You love it. Shut up. Got the taser. Yeah, I know. Yeah, you just kick me. Who is this guy? What's his name? Mom, quit crying, please. Okay. Is that him? Yeah. Well, buddy, you got warrants. What'd you say? You got warrants. What'd you say, Mom? I don't know what my glove was. Well, he's trying to fight us for no reason. Don't get up. 
Mom, chill out, dude. Mom, get the f away, mom. God. Nope, you don't stay right here. Mom. 3313, where's the status on other units? Mom, get the f Can you please go? Mom. He's probably high on something. Oh. Yeah. What happened last Sunday? I don't know you. Yeah, I, I know you don't know me. Y'all want you in here? I know y'all want me. What the f? Let's go with this. What this is? Because I got warrants for. You do got warrants? For what? You got Yep, and now you got her assisting arrest as well. Oh, for real? Yep. The officers deduced that Santiago must have been on some drugs to be able to withstand the current for that long. Finally, he was taken to the cop car. You got a water bottle? Nope. Give me a water bottle less. That's all right, man. This ain't fing. We in Walmart, we didn't just carry groceries on us. I ain't made it before. Come on, get in there. Yeah, we have to go to the hospital. Yeah. Did you got a taste? That's fine. Is Pong still in there? Yeah. No, they're right. Sorry. Thanks, all of you. Are you trying to take your taste? Yeah. So you got punched in the mouth. Yeah, so at some point he just got started getting punched in the mouth. So he has to bust the mouth and I have to go get there. Well, he's eating his. Yeah. He's he literally ate it. He stopped. He got hit right there. I tried to throw him on the ground. He ran. Popped him right here again. Well, he kicked me. I felt bad, but I popped him and he fell and just kept on trying to fight. And like I said, he went. He tried to grab my taser, tried to grab Redden, so I started just punching him. We didn't know it was going to be he like that. Hands on, he fing started. As soon as, we, as soon as I grabbed his head, he started swinging. I popped him, ate that. Um, he popped him, ate that shit. I pulled that oh, second one. No he, way. He, he started to, uh, like, to feel the effects, took off running. He popped him for his second taser. So he yeah, fell to the ground. Four times on each one. He ate him. He did not make it close. Oh. No, this, the, mine, the second one made it, but he just ate it. And then the second no one, way. he was running. Yeah, bro, he's eating that shit. He's hot as fuck. And then he, the second one, he fell to the ground, but he was still kicking, fighting. We tried to go hands on, and that's when he. Are ate. you guys okay? Yeah. The cops had a brief discussion of the day's events among themselves, after which Santiago was taken down to the hospital. Was he, was he, where did he start that fire? Across the street? Yeah, so apparently he was trying to scare the mom. And that's why Dusty called Benny and was like, hey man, this guy has warrants, but I'm not going to follow on him until tomorrow morning. Because comes to find out, he was trying to scare mom because he got upset at her, lit it up on fire. And that's why Dusty was like, hey man, like tomorrow in the morning I'll file. Dusty or Rusty? Rusty, my bad. He's like, because, uh... That dude, he, he's gone over across the street to that business before yeah. and caused problems over there. Santiago was charged with resisting arrest, attempting to take a weapon from an officer, criminal trespass, violation of probation, possession of a controlled substance, and public intoxication. But wait until you see how this daughter acted after being told to give $50 in rent. Don't touch me. You saw her, right? Did this! Yo, I got hey, more money than hey, you, hey, you, and hey, you combined. Hey, I seconds. did not move! For two Shut the f up! Because I did not move! I did not move! In December 2021, officers received a call from a distressed mother reporting her drunk daughter who was causing a disturbance. They arrived on the scene in hopes of solving the situation, but were met with a challenge greater than expected. Go now. Same issue? Yeah. Put your clothes on before he has to come in here and get you. Can Just you, leave. Can you come out here real quick? She doesn't hear us. They had an argument when I was at the store mm -hmm. about fifty dollars. What twenty-one year olds you know live in a house and pay nothing? I'm doing y'all a favor. You gotta kick her out. That's the only way she's gonna learn. Otherwise, she's gonna be here at forty. Is this a recurring problem? No. She had a handle on it, and I think something happened at work. And then I told the alcohol, yeah. She doesn't know how to drink, really. She probably, she overdrank. But she just keeps on going. So, I mean, I want her to know that this is true. And she's like, I'm never going to talk to you again. That's what you feel you have to do. I'm not going to pick anybody over myself. I'm trying to talk to them. Every time I try to talk to them, it's always Dr. Phil, Dr. Phil. 
I'm really trying to help them with their trauma because I know it's true. But you're not going to keep treating me like crap and my boyfriend wants to leave. I don't blame him. Why do we have to deal with this bullshit? And I know she's on a loop because she saved my ex-husband's name. So I know that she's going through her feelings and stuff, but I'm not going to just let you act this way. She makes more money, they go get an apartment and live happily ever after. Make your own money. She's a great girl. She doesn't know what to She's getting packed or um, is she still doing that? I don't know. I want to see the mother explained the ways she was terrorized by her own daughter before the daughter finally walked out with an attitude. Yeah, I got this shit. And mind you, I pay bills. So, it early ass in the fucking morning, I'm getting tried because I am no. doing what I can out of 20 years old, and you will do the same fucking thing. Now, granted, I pay bills. Stop screaming. I pay bills. And no, no, no. I, I will. I will. I am. I am, I am, I am, but I pay bills, I pay bills now, granted, I can look crazy all the I want, because I'm the one who pays bills, I'm the one who paid cable, I'm the one who's 21 years old, you can look at my shit, and I, I promise, I will pay check more than my mother, why is your mouth other than you, other than you, other than you, other than you, and this really is an interaction with my mother, I pay her bills, $50? Come on, Nana. I pay her something because she can, can, asked can me you, to. Can you remove her? You're 21 years old. Listen, listen. I'm, I'm going to speak to you seriously. <laughs> Yo, so I came out here 20 years old. She can asked me. I will take her, her to go either. get. Yo, no, I'm Brennan. Brennan, listen to me. Make her leave. I'm going to get my fucking. My Go girl away. is. My girl is in there right now packing all my sh So okay. granted, I am ready to leave. So you're the youngest fucking age. So I'm gonna relate to him because he's the youngest fucking age. And yes, How I am know? lit. But granted, you will look at my bank account and be like, oh, this is the bitch I shouldn't be fucking with. So granted, my mother look, has never fucking seen this shit. No, granted, granted. I understand what you're saying. Granted, granted. She will leave me out here. I know she I can pay for fucking more. I can pay for this. I can pay for this. Granted, granted. You're, you're granted. disrespecting her. No, no, yes, you are. no, 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 no. That's the f shit. I pay you're for not, her bills, and I'm sitting here. I'm sitting here. I'm sitting here by the end of the day, like sitting on my right TV. Now. Yeah, right now, yeah. right now, because I pay bills. For so money. you're supposed to leave right now. Granted, granted. Yes, right now, so right now. So pack up and grab and go. Granted. You're not making any sense. Granted, I pay bills. I can fucking know what she cares. does. Don't touch me. You saw her, right? You saw her, right? You saw her touch me, right? You saw her touch me. This is the problem. Judging by the daughter's behavior, it was easy to tell why her mother was so fed up with her. From that point on, things only escalated. This is the problem. Leave and don't come back. You have utilized the police officer. Leave and don't come back. 16 years old. Did we call? Did we call? Yeah. Call. Come here. You want to see my bank card? No, I don't. You want to see my bank card? No, I don't. You see, I'm hot, lit, hot, and dry, Because my mother has utilized the police officer not once, not twice, but over three of her children. Stop. Look forward. Look forward. Yo. You don't want to like and utilize, but I will walk into the front Stop. of the pub. Stop. Stop. Stop nah, resisting, bro. Because this is the second time you have utilized a cop on my Stop. ass. Look, issues. look, you won't see me move. You won't see me move. Because I am utilized. Yo, what, what is I have your, money on my bank removed? account. If that's removed. Is this you're going to continue? We're going to babysit here? If you can take me off that her, gas, I will show you my bank account Jenny, and my ID okay, okay. that will show that I have money. Okay. Though. What is what is wet on you on this side? Come over can here. I ask you what, what is that? I literally look forward. No, little stop. No, stop no. Pulling. Look at me. You are young as my me. You're as young as me. Okay, and I'm not my acting mother, like this. Stop. My mother has utilized this police officer since I was 14 years old. Okay, yeah. And I am the one person that made my job for you. I may be as young as you, but I'm not acting like you right now, and you need to stop acting. Exactly, like and you're not gonna make money like I am. So, Brandon, I will get in this police officer. I will get in that handcuff, and I will still make more better than you. 
So I need to do what you have to do. This is illegal, bro. This is illegal, bro. No, bro. Listen Mom. to me. I will pay you. Bro, I will show you my fucking bacon home, bro. Come on. I will show you my both fucking bacon home. This deal. Yo. I'm not fucking slapped by fucking dumb shit. I fucking live because I am literally home. And you like niggas are telling me shit that is not fucking true because I have more money Come than my fucking mother, bro. Stop. Yo. Ariana, stop. Janisa, they... Mom. Mom, they are literally arresting me again while you utilize a cop as they fucking do the same thing that he did to all your three of your friends. Three! Three of your fucking children! Mom. They got my ass doing the same shit Why I have more money than they fucking that. Bro! Bro, they should not be utilizing my ass because of you! No, bro! You're gonna fall, stop! Stop fighting! Why are you doing all that? Because I'm in more money than you bro! You're gonna make this worse! I don't get Stop! Alright, we'll stay here. We're gonna stay here the whole time, huh? You wanna stay here on the ground? The daughter started resisting against the officers, claiming she had more money than them. She then only got louder. Yeah, so I can make my case. Stop. Janisha! Yeah, because you are my mother! You are my mother! And I've literally given her everything she asked for! I make more money than you! I f***ing hustle more than you! And you can't f***ing take that for granted! Because okay. I have a little dream. Stop. Hey, boys. You can't hit your mom. No one I hit my mom. We yeah. saw you hit your mom. You didn't lose that f***. You will pay any attention that will gain you leverage. And that's cool. Granted. Granted. But I will make $1,500 over that. Off the f***ing week. Off of doing that illegally. Wait. Are we going to stand up? If we want to go to the deposit. And I feel like my mom made money. Because my Come mom doesn't. And I do. Look that way. Come on. No. Want, Keep walking. Do you, you have want resistance charges? No, I want to record. Can walk with record. Us? Record. No. I understand. They're not recording. They're not recording. It doesn't matter. As you live 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 they're trying to be nice to you. Go with it. I'm not 18. Okay. I'm not 18, and you don't have a car. And I'm not 18, and I don't have more money than all of you. Just come on. That's great. Yeah. Just hold me. Yeah. You ran a bra or anything? No, no because you can utilize my. Stand up straight. I'm not playing with you. Come on. Hey, you, you, Ariana. Yeah, push me, bro. Push me, bro. No, you're I the really... one that's pushing. No, Stop. you're not recording. You are not recording. Come on. Ariana. No, recording. Recording. Be in the car. Stop. Recording. Stop. Recording. On, you're not. You're not, bro. Ariana, Stop. Stop. You're not. Get in the car. You're not recording me, bro. Yo, listen to me. Get you in the car. Go away. You literally can get me in the Call by recording because that is why you are we are. Why you get why I am. Great, you did your job. Stop. Just let me take you. Yeah, you're not gonna get me. Stop. Get in the car. Stop. You can say that you did something. But you ain't just shit. That a twenty year old did. Put a leg in. Shut it. Stop. Get in the car. Don't worry about the seatbelt. Stop. Get in the car. You start kicking, that's another charge. Hey, so stop I have more money than that. All right, watch your foot. If she had that much money, a $50 fine should be no problem. Unfortunately, her uncooperativeness didn't end there and forced the officers to resort to a dire tactic. All right. Stop. Give me your head. Stop. stop. Follow directions. Give me your Just head. Just do it, okay? I'm going to need one of you to bring her. Dude, I am I'm not moved here. You have no right to put me on a fing mask when I'm Stop. Stop. Dude, You're gonna dude. get charged with battery dude. reasons, babe. Dude. dude, you're gonna get charged for battery if you do that. Dude, babe. you have no right to put me in a fing mask. Well, well, well. I am fucking push resistance at all. Babe. And you, you are, are putting me in a fing mask. 
because you have so many things to understand. And you are literally trying me. You are literally trying me. I've tried. I've had a lot worse for my mother resting. I will not have a mask on. Exactly. So why the enough? Oh my ass. Get in the car, baby. Get in the car, baby. Lay down. I know the right nah. if I was sitting there. You have know the right if I was sitting there. But yeah, I don't. Bro. I see that. I see. Just sit. Yo, I got hey. more money than hey. you. Hey. You hey. and you hey. combined. Hey. Sit. But oh, hey. come on. Breathe. For two hey, seconds. Hey, I did not move. For two Shut seconds. the f up. Because I did not move. I did not move. I need to move babe. for over 30 minutes. Babe, babe. Oh my god. What are you doing? I sat there babe. and waited for right. my right. rights yeah, to get be your hair out of your face. Ass. No, bro. Okay, babe. keep it there then. Yeah, bro. Because, 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 Stop. Stop. Neighbors Stop. called. Your window was open. They could hear all the ruckus. They called. All you had to do. Stop. Is Stop. Stop moving. Bro, did you do coke? Did you do anything? Seriously, I just, I just want to know. this thing is really go the I'm done with you. And I'm no better. Just like this. All right, we need your help. Okay, Ariana? Yo, I need you to sit down. Ariana, come on. Stand her up. Feet down. All right. All right, of the numerous charges the suspect got, one of them was an assault on a law enforcement officer. The examples of spoiled children don't run out, as this son broke his mother's property while in an argument with her. About to hit me. Y'all ready to push me? I had stitches one time. I let that go. I didn't report that. He literally broke my the stove, man. He got to leave. I, was, I can't keep going through this shit every night. Hey! Carol. Hey! Stop. 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 Don't Come outside. On the 23rd of March, 2023, police officers received a call from a distressed mother reporting an altercation between her and her son that had gone a bit too far. When the officers arrived at the scene, to understand who they were going to deal with, they first approached the woman who gave them an insight into the horrible things that her son had done to her. Well, I'm sorry. I don't know. My son on that. All that shit. I just got everything. I just took it out. I my stove and everything. Okay. Come on, he's got to leave here. I can't. I ran from this woman. You know, he, he literally broke my stove. Look, I was going there. Look, he told me, you ain't my mama, bitch. I'm going to kill you, hoe. Where my mama at? I'm like, here, I am your mama. Yeah. Where's he at? He in the house. He literally broke my the stove, man. Okay. Punched it. The, the top of it. Look. Okay. He got to leave. I, was, I can't keep going through this shit every night. I'll press the charge. I am. He got to leave him. This is this woman's place, man. I agree. Don't come to see though. About to hit me. Y'all ready to push me? I had stitches one time. I let that go. I didn't report that. Right after discussing with her, the officers proceeded to approach the young man, who would possibly turn out to be one of the worst brats the officers had ever come across in their entire career. What's up, Harold? Harold, Harold, come outside. Come on, man. You don't gotta do that, huh? Harold, go out there. No, 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 let him in. What you talking about? Let him in for what? Let him in for what? No, I'm a bitch. I'm a whole ain't your hey, mama. I ain't no bitch in no hey, home, no. Hey, Harold. I ain't do nothing yet. Come outside. Hold on, sir. Stop. Put that down. Stop. Harold. Hold on. Hold on. Hey. Harold. Hey. Stop. 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 Don't Come outside. Hey, Get on the ground. Get on the ground. What's up for the table? On the ground. Get on the ground, Harold. What I did. What's up, Taylor? What's up? Other hand. What did you use Harold's decay? What's y'all came to my house for? What I did? Did your mom let us in? What she let y'all in for? Stay right there. What did you put in? So you finna press charge on me? Hello? So you finna press charge on me? No. Hey, Where did it go? 
What gold? What was in your hand? What? What is what in my hand, man? Them was something that she be be lighting up in here, man. There was nothing in my hand. Yeah, I did. There was nothing in my hand. Uh, oh my God! I'm so tired, man. Y'all just can't take me jail for this, like for no reason. Y'all be running my house, okay. and I'll call y'all. I be telling y'all she be messing with me. No, I'm pressing charges on her first. So no, you cannot take me to jail. I didn't do nothing. This is my house. Don't treat me like that. I just not got out of jail. Do not treat me like that. Is it in there? This is my house. Uh -huh. This is not your house. I don't have nothing on me at all. Stay away from that table. I sure am. Ma'am. That's stuff that she has. Ma'am. Ma'am, can you just wait outside for us? Yeah, I went to, I've been, I've been to the hospital. How? How? Can you just wait outside for us? You're just always calling me. Stop doing that. Stop doing that. Stop doing that. Y'all want to call somebody for nothing. For nothing. It ain't nothing going on at all. I only want to call somebody. As things unfolded, rather than comply with the officers, he decided to show the officers how much of a nuisance he was and why they needed to have him removed from the premises as soon as possible. Ain't hey, nothing going on. They told him, I don't got nothing on me. What you don't touch my ass? Please do not rape me. I'm telling you, I'm a fresh charges. Do not rape me. Well, I just told you I ain't do nothing. I don't got nothing on me. You're not finna see my ass, Chief. That's what you're not gonna do now. Now you can let me out these hands because I'm ain't do nothing. I'm gonna pull your pants up for you. I'm gonna pull up myself. You don't gotta touch me. Please do not touch okay. me. You just tried to rape me. You just tried to rape me now. Stop. Stop. You just tried to rape me. I just told you I don't got nothing in my pocket. I'm not gonna let you rape me. That's just my ID card. That's just my ID card, sir. Because I always call y'all and tell y'all she be messing with me. Stop. I just told you. Calm down. Hey, I'm calm right, down. Right. I called y'all. How y'all gonna get mad at me when I called y'all? Really? For her stuff that's on the table? Really? Okay. Come on, she light that up every day. Nobody don't talk shit. When she talk shit, dog, I'm just trying to protect my family. I called y'all. How you gonna take me to jail? How you gonna take me to jail because I called y'all? Yeah, I see him. How you gonna take me to jail because I called y'all? What? You see what? what? That ain't nothing. What happened here? You see what? That's her stuff. That's what no, she got. No, I'm talking about the stove. What happened to the stove? Oh, the stove, bro. Why did you carry me out of the house like this? Why did you carry me out of the house like this? What are you doing? Let me sit down in my house. What are you doing? What are you doing? Ain't nothing going on. I ain't going nowhere. What are they doing? I'm not. Hey, going Robo. Can you press charge on me? None of that stuff is not mine. This what are you talking about? Y'all just come to people's house. Come on now. Talking about drugs. There ain't no drugs in here. How you gonna tell us my stuff? Just can right. you just stay out of the house until we get back? No, I ain't gonna just no. Okay. I ain't do nothing. You gonna press charges on me? Robo. Let's come on, you gonna press charges on me? Okay, just stay you, Don't you, go in the house. Come on now, you know I ain't do nothing more. I ain't that, do nothing okay then, they just can't take that I ain't going to jail. I think it's a when I called y'all, I can't go to jail. Yeah. When I called y'all. I have a little When I called y'all. I got one, I'll grab it. I called y'all. So how I'm gonna go to jail? How I'm gonna go to jail when I called y'all? Oh, do you got a bag? I'll yeah. be on Just that. grab a bag and test it. How I'm gonna go to jail when I called y'all? If nothing else, we got 31. Despite him already being in cuffs, he still felt like the cops had no justification to arrest him. However, he would soon come to understand that things were more serious than they appeared. I'm gonna go to jail when I call y'all. What are y'all doing? You can your hands off of me, please. How you gonna take me to jail when I call y'all? You just can't do that in my own home? You didn't call her. Yes, I did call y'all. Your mom called I don't want to get the report. Your mom called What report? I don't want that get the report. What report? That When I called y'all. When did you call she, us? She pressed charge on me. How y'all going to take me? No, you can't take me to jail for that. When did you call us? No, I didn't do nothing. I just not called y'all. I told y'all she was snapping on me. How you just going to uh, try to do something like that? Or tamper with she, she, No, she is not. She is not pressed charge on me. I ain't trouble with nothing. What did you talk about? So don't try to act like she pressure charge on me, please. Grab a Not bag. try to act like she pressure charge on me. I want to search him again before we... Okay, I can search him all day. You're going to search my ass. You're going to search my ass. Is there something in your ass? No, it ain't nothing in my ass. Okay. You ain't going to go in my ass. I'm not, definitely You're definitely not, not going to do that. Why do you got your hands up on me like I'm arrested? You are arrested. No, I'm not. You're going to jail. No, I'm not. For what? I didn't do nothing. For a possession. For possession of what? Whatever, Possession of what? 
We're about to test it. Possession. Test it for what? Possession, tampering. Tamper with what? Because you grabbed it and you're running your room. Resisting. I didn't grab Resisting. nothing. Resisting. You ain't seen me resist nothing. That's why you have to be held at taser point? I know I'm going to beat that. Okay. I know I'm going to beat that. I know I'm going to beat that. I know I'm going to beat that. You know I don't got nothing on me, sir. So can you please stop trying to search my ass? At this point, to make sure that he wasn't carrying anything dangerous on him, the officers needed to search him, and this didn't go down well with him. It was after this search that they found something on him that could explain why he had a terrible personality. You got nothing on me, so please stop trying to search my ass. You just took my money from out of my pocket. You just not took my money from out of my pocket. Yeah, no. It's on the table. Okay then. You just not said you steady searching me. Stop. I'm trying to hold my pants up. Let go. Let me hold my pants up. Harold, knock it off. Man, that shit Stop. don't hurt me, man. That Stop. shit don't hurt me, bro. That shit not hurt me, bro. I don't want that to. That shit hurt. don't hurt me, bro. That shit don't hurt me. All that dumb shit. Y'all just can't arrest me when I called y'all. What did you want my pants for, sir? I just told you I don't got nothing Stop. in my pants. Let me pull up okay, my pants. Can you see? I'm point two. Put your feet in. Okay. Put my feet in for what? Put your feet in. Put my feet in for what? Stop. Move your foot. Okay. What's going on? Oh, who do something fuck you around here? Look oh, how you acting. Shit, bro. I be telling you when I be chilling, bro, don't fuck me. You're don't not fuck chilling with her. That's your mom, though. Why I just be chilling. Don't come fucking with me. You're not even yourself right now, bro. Hey, oh, I ain't worrying about that. <laughs> I don't think she called the police. Somebody else did. Okay, then. Tell us about your first charge. She ain't pressing charges. They found your drugs. What drugs? Either way, on me. what possessed you to punch the um, the, the punch um, what? The stove, or whatever you did to it. What's the stove, been bro? What did you talk about? Okay, I get it, cause police right here. But why? That's your mama. When she when she done with you, where you gonna go? You man, got your sister, about, man, but still. Talk about that shit. I get that shit on my own, man. I'm going back to Baton Rouge. This young boy, stop playing with me. Y'all know what's up, my top. Y'all know what's up. Y'all know what she did. But I came from Baton Rouge. Stop playing me. Stop playing. Me. Oh, well, how are you? You make me want to cry because you're not even yourself no more, bro. I know. And you only get like that when you. Don't stop talking. And I'm not gonna stop because you need you need to hear my mouth. That's why you're still doing. Just when the officers thought that they had seen all that he was hiding, another search at the police station revealed that they might have grossly underestimated him. That's what somebody leave me alone. Come on, see me. Oh, there's another one. Is this rocks? This is rocks. Yeah. Rocks? He has so many shoes. He has rocks up on him. Rocks? Rocks? Yeah, he had the same stuff in the house. Oh, that's good. Okay. Rocks? They gonna test his rocks. This man gets his rocks. Country ass stuff? Yes. Tears. Who put those on? Tears. Like the stone. Tears. So that actually may be a rock. Yeah, yeah. Something like that. Man, you know that you always just picking up some country. Go home, man. You don't want to fuck with me. Go home. I'm still going to get out. Okay. I'm going to request that you don't have a bond. I'll make that simple so you got to see the judge. I don't care. I need to rest me, in the end, he was charged with possession of dimethyl pentalone, tampering with physical evidence, possession of paraphernalia, resisting arrest without violence, and possession of cocaine. The next child was just lacking in the IQ department as he tried running off when officers approached him. We're gonna sit here all day until you calm down. Bro, I don't give a f about you, bro. Okay. I hate that, you, bro. On the 3rd of March, 2023, officers received a distress call from a troubled mother regarding her 13-year-old son, who had become a total nuisance. When the officers arrived at the scene and approached the teenager, he quickly showed them that he wasn't a novice in the art of running from the law. Hello. Hello. Oh. Well, there is. What? You returned home, right? Oh, I guess you were missing. We had to come check on you and make sure you're okay. Okay. Where you been staying? Alright. Is uh mom here? I'm the guardian. You're the guardian? Okay. I think they're 26 right now. Alright, well, Ladarius, you gotta come with us. 
Stop fighting. Stop. Take a breath. You're fine. You're fine. I'll be in front of my computer in a few minutes and I'll start finding you in a second clear. Any calls that are holding for like an hour or more, if we can refer them to our online recording, that'd be great. At this point, he had realized that he was going to jail. However, he was not just about to go down without a fight. Eventually, the cops had to talk to his mother about him. It was at that moment they had realized how much of a nightmare he had been to her. Listen, let me tell you something. He has a hunt. I bet he knew. I bet multiple warrants. I bet he knew. This the light. This the light he wanted to be in. I can guarantee you, I wasn't hurting him. Okay. Well, at least you We have to. We have to control him. You can say what you want. We have to control him. We have to control him. I understand. Yeah. Back in the vehicle, things were getting really crazy. He was now, more than ever, determined not to go to jail. And for a moment, it seems like the cops were never going to be able to contain him. Oh, 
Although the cops kept warning him about the possible consequences of his actions, he didn't care about what they had to say if it wasn't related to his not going to jail. stop doing that! Because guess what? You're making it worse for yourself! You're making it worse for yourself, Joy. You know, when you get there, you're going to end up in the body. Like, you're going to black. Calm down! Stop. Exactly. Cut that shit out! But you'll be up in here acting out hard. Calm down! Calm down! You mad! He's gonna be transported to the death. Stop, stop doing that. Stop doing that. You gonna end up getting no. hurt. He gonna end up getting hurt. That's the shit he's doing. Stop. 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 In the end, he was charged with resisting arrest with simple assault. But that's nothing compared to this entitled daughter who refused to leave her parents' property despite being told to. I'm done talking. I'm done. Ah, okay. Now you've got me really f***ing frustrated. Bravo, you got me really f***ing frustrated. Back up. I'm telling you now, back up. Bitch, don't tell me what f you do. On the 24th of January, 2023, police officers responded to a call reporting a domestic disturbance involving a daughter who had refused to leave her parents' place of abode despite being evicted. The officers arrived at the scene to meet a crazy young lady who, apart from being awfully entitled, also had the worst attitude to go with it. Where's my mail, my first and last name's on it, with your address, daddy-o? Used to, but guess what? You legally, legally evict me then. I'll walk in that house and he won't do shit because he can't. I will. I what know. are you going to do? Beat me? Ma'am, let's go back over here. Are you going to beat me? Let's beat me then. Beat me in front of the f***ing cop. You won't. Listen, you won't do not, it. Just wait. This, okay? wait. 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 I'm not done. Sir, I'm not done speaking. Oh. Let me f***ing speak. Yes, you can speak, but Get I'm not going to have this where you Literally. and your father are escalating. Why? Because okay. he's going to beat me. You know? No, it has nothing to beat. Babe, babe, Bravo, listen to me. I don't, want you, me. I don't want you and him to get physical. So that's Why? Because I'm already char I'm already filing. That's the end of this. Okay, and I'm getting fine. my $20,000. Okay, listen, that's fine. But trust but me, I'm going to sit on a porch because this, this is my calm space. This is my entire home. You have a seat. I'll ruin his Porsche while I'm at it. Yeah, I'll ruin your Porsche. I'll sit my ass right on it. My rich ass right on it. Because guess who made me rich, daddy? A school shooting. A school shooting that you weren't around for because you were at work making money and stuffing with it. And then we want to talk about Eric. You want to talk about both Eric's? Yo, get your princess wife over here. I'll beat the brakes off of her just because. And I'll do it when nobody's around while she's sleeping. Because you will even know when I'm coming. Mother you dumb mother you beat the shit out of me. Like I get beat in the Baker Act facilities by black men. I get my I get my shit rocked by you guys. I'm not even joking. And I'm not even joking. Right. My shit rocked. I'm tired of being hit by men and doing nothing about it. 7797. Can I speak to Anderson? Right, yeah, you can speak to Anderson. Cool. I'm not suing him anymore. You're not suing him? That's good. No, I can't. Okay. Although it was clear that she was going to give them a tough time, the cops decided that it was best to give her all possible chances to behave herself and calmly leave the premises. But for some reason, it was either she had her way or nothing. Okay. I'm gonna fight this one right in front of his f***ing cool ass face. Alright, so... Oh, uh, uh, daughter beater. Come on. Pull the files out. We're gonna... We're gonna... I'm gonna work you guys today, alright? I know you need your job, so I'm not hard. 
ready? Are we ready to run the file on the domestic abuse? Are you ready to run it? I'm ready. Where's she wants papers? to talk to you, uh, Mr. Domestic Anderson. She's not suing you anymore, so that's good. I ain't, no, not you. I ain't suing him. So I'm suing him. background that I have right now. My father. He's got oh, my money. Okay. This white trash got my money. He's so desperate for his... So, so, so the background I that I have right now is... Yeah, we got a little um, bit from him. Yeah. So what's going on? What happened now? Okay. I, th I, th I thought soberly for like 12 hours. That's what I did. Okay. I smoked weed, so... I thought soberly for 12 hours, and I was like, there's no way a third man in my life is going to hit me, and I'm not going to do anything about it. Four, excuse me. Yeah, four. And especially my father... When, like, literally, I've been baker acted, I, excuse me, I baker acted myself three times. I was gonna bake my, baker act myself yesterday. At one something, I have messages. But then I came back here. I came back here like three times. So, what are we here for today? Honestly, hypothetically speaking, if y'all weren't here, most likely, he wouldn't probably have a heartbeat. Or he would have this ring and the eyeball. Because honestly, I was gonna call you guys, I was gonna f this place up. Just cuz. That princess, I'm so tired of her. I'm so tired of her right now. And That's your my, sister you're no, about? no, my stepmom. I'm tired I'm tired I'm tired of her literally running her this house when she broke up another house. Who's and Amanda? I, Is that your sister? My sister, my stepsister, her daughter. Uh you guys get along? Yeah? You tight? Very well. And she didn't say anything about me beating, my dad beating me, of course. But she defends her mom at the end of the day. And I told her, I don't want to get you involved. And she's here running her f***ing mouth here. And she's also running her mouth on my phone. I have it all. So what are we trying to accomplish today? Uh, honestly, you baker at him. And I get my money. And I get my domestic charge file going. Of course, I got one, two, three. I'm getting rich. He's going locked up, whether that's jail or Baker Act, because he tried to kill me, or he's trying to hurt others right now. And in the state of the law, you guys would be at fault, Mr. Barr. And I don't, I remember your name. It's a good thing I'm doing this off the gate. Um, but yeah, so those are my three solutions, and I'm not leaving this course until I get it. As things unfolded, it started becoming obvious that she was just an entitled brat who had been a problem to her father, and who had no reason to make life so miserable for him. And if anything, it's my house, I like the sh** fire. Literally. But not, a, when not anything new around. If I want to, hypothetically, all this to speak to of course. Well, I thought you said you were here for your wallet and your mail. Oh, now I'm adding sh** on because this is taking way too long. You know, I have to understand, the longer I... The longer I wait, because I'm losing money right now, because I gotta go to my tire, my fifty-five thousand dollars check dropped last night, like I told you. In the eighty-seven. Um, so the money's not the issue, but now he's okay. getting a little nitty gritty. So I'm gonna get a little nitty gritty, and I'll do it all day. Cause guess what? I slept, and that's a good thing. Well, that's good. You well rested? Oh yeah. <laughs> I've got it going right now. I'm healthy, sober, and happy, and this oh, yeah. is really. But if you have all of that going, why would you come over here and let that bring you? Because you, know you have what I mean? to understand the amount of years of abuse and like not look, not look, not look neglect, but mm -hmm. it's like just the presence of being a positive parent, I guess, and not being under the influence or not teaching me a lesson every single time we have to talk or how I spend my money or why I'm doing smoking pot or why I'm not drinking alcohol or like this or that, why I dropped out of high school because my school got shot up, sorry, or my uh, my Sonia, my Sonia, my cousin Sonia dies two days later when I'm 16 years old, and that induces my bipolar one psychosis, the genetics I got from him, why eliminate, why not eliminate 50% of it, because I got the other 50% living with me, that I house her, I house that woman, my mother, he didn't do shit for her, I paid her $400 for two kids, he made so much goddamn money. That pussy ass father. I'm so tired of this shit. Well, here's here's my question. Mm -hmm. What's your question? If, it sounds like you're happier and better off when you don't have any interaction with him. You're correct? right, but this is the final one, and I'm not coming ever back here again. Because all I'm just saying, and it's your decision, just close that chapter. I'm trying. This is it. This you're is at what age now? 21. 
I'm trying to. Right. You know this what I mean? What I'm this is the only way to do it, unfortunately, with my father. Because you mm -hmm. know why? His oldest son is a cop. And he calls me last night. My brother didn't call me last night. I didn't answer. Because I'm going to call him tonight. Because okay. guess what? I, listen. Power. I'm going to sit here and literally confuse your brain. Trust me, I can do it. While she continued being a brat, she was failing to realize that she was already beginning to overstep her boundaries. You're saying it's personal. Mm -hmm. It seems like a better approach that you have right now is handling things with him in the civil circuit. It doesn't work like that. We are personalities, well, you said, you said, not too hard. Well, you said there's money involved, right? I don't. I, I don't play with my money. I'll do anything so, for it. That's what I'm saying. It's over my life. Well, that's, that's, that's how I got that money. I sued the FBI and BSO. So let's fight. What? I told him that yesterday. I'm done talking. What? I'm done. Ah, okay. Now you've got me really frustrated. You got me really. Back up, please. Back up. I'm about to get off the card. Back up. I'm telling you now. Back up. Don't play with me. Because guess what? I remember your face. And that uniform doesn't mean shit when you're off the clock. Because guess what? One, two, three are right here. And guess what? My own brother is a India, cop. And guess what? I could be a cop. I'm just too fucking crazy. I won't pass no psyche down. Don't worry. I've tried. You can let me know now. I'm already mad, so you might as well get me more mad. Actually, I'm not going to listen to you, to be honest. So, you missed your opportunity, sir. Officer. I can't hear you. I have a hearing problem. Take your mask up and show your face, sir. Ma'am, if you don't listen to our commands when I'm done with you, you're going to go to jail. Do you understand? Yes or no? Okay, I'll get back with you in one minute. Okay, then. So I'm gonna get up right now and go to my property. Nope. I'm gonna go to my house and my room inside. Is that a problem? If I enter this home? Yes, ma'am. Is it a problem? Why yeah, is it a problem? I live here, you no? Know? He's saying that you don't live here. How is, how is he gonna prove it? There was a conversation that was had with your mom that you live with her now. When? Yesterday. About what? About you living with your mom now. I don't remember that. I was off of five days no sleep. I don't remember that. I don't know what you're talking about. To be honest. At this point, all she was doing was showing the cops how much of a nuisance she had been to her parents and why they had been called in the first place. And even at that, the cops still decided to give her a few more chances to avoid getting into trouble. I live here. Trust me. I, you can have two homes, don't worry. Is there a back patio? Female officer is gonna explain a form to you. Are you willing to come out front and talk to her? I'm not moving for my form. I'm what? If, no, no, no. if we get you a towel, will you dry off and come out front? I'll just come out on front and dry, but I need my jewelry. It's right here. I'm gonna take pictures of everything. My memory ain't that sharp. Unless I'm in the institution. You you prefer the female officer explaining everything? I to actually you? really like you. So let me respond to my mother. She'll get her out right over here. Trust me. Oh wait. Look at that. She's already talking about rent. Yeah. You don't have to tell her about that. No, it's, it's going to be uneventful. 
Am I getting? I'm not in jail. Just be honest. Just don't don't get yourself jammed up. If you agree to sign the paper and then you leave, you're not gonna have a problem. But I need my money. I just need my debit card. Debit card? Yeah, it's in there. It's on the mail. Okay, I'll get you your debit card. Yeah, that's all I want. Okay, uh, get your can... stuff and I'll meet you over okay. here by your car. Eventually, the cops issued her a trespass warning, and she reluctantly left the property. But that didn't mean the cops had seen the last of her. It wasn't long before she returned to the property to cause more chaos and catch a traffic violation in the process. However, this time, the cops were ready to teach her that even rich, spoiled kids go to jail. Can I have your driver's license? So I'm gonna cite you again if you don't have your driver's license on demand on traffic stop. Ma'am, I need your driver's license. If you continue to walk away from this traffic stop, you're gonna to go to jail for obstruction. Do you understand? Yes or no? Eventually, the cops got fed up with her craziness and decided to take her in. And when she began to realize that things had turned against her, it was a bit too late. Do you understand you're gonna to go to jail? Yes or no? Stop, ma'am. Stop. I'm gonna kill myself. Stop. Stop. Why aren't you f***ing doing anything about it? Ma'am. Why aren't you there doing you anything you about it? Your hands behind your back. There you go. You're doing great. Yeah, I know. You're doing great, ma'am. Yeah, I f***ing know. I'm still gonna issue you Bitch, don't tell me what the f*** you do. No. We're also gonna tell your car for being on a public roadway. Why? It's, on a, it's an emergency. No, it's my... blocking a private driveway, what, That I own? That you're getting a citation for. Okay, baby. I can pay it off. Good for you, ma'am. Because I'll pay your Good for you. Yeah, Daddy, all for you. Jesus Christ, you guys are bitches. Not you, and not you. You too. All right, ma'am, you you're, you're under lucky. you're under arrest for obstructing a traffic uh, a traffic investigation. Do you understand? You sure, you don't want to give me for the trespassing. Come on, do it all. We're gonna Rock have it all a 1015 on. for resisting. I'm not resisting. You are, ma'am. You walk away myself. from the traffic stop after I order to myself. save it. I want to kill myself. I don't know what you're talking about. Yourself. I want to kill myself. That's fine. The, 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 the jail is a receiving no, facility, ma'am. I want to kill myself. We can absolutely get you the evaluation you need at the main jail. Good for you. And then your vehicle is going to get towed. I'll do this all for my daddy. So you are going to go to jail. We're going to tow your car from the roadway because it's clearly disabled. And in front of a private driveway, which you're going to get cited for. I can't even hear you right now. You're talking in my bad ear. What the f***? I don't know what are you saying. I can't hear him. That's fine. No. Raise it for me. Raise it for me. Raise it for me. I'll back both of you up because I'm just strong like that, baby. When I'm mad, yeah, lock me up. Despite being neck deep in a mess that she had created for herself, being an entitled brat, she still felt like she was in a position to make demands. But at this point, the cops didn't mind teaching her that the world didn't revolve around her. Just send me to Larkin or Coral Springs Hospital, please. Just make your no, life easy. That's not how it works anymore. <laughs> Don't you think that? Okay. And guess what? He still, he still hit me. He still hit me. I'll go to jail for him. I'll die for him. 
Because that's how I run. <laughs> I locked up for you. Just because I want my f***ing money. It's, just, it's a good thing he's not f***ing there. Because I, I was going to shoot him off. Hey, type of shit. Come on! Man. Come on! Yeah, you're gonna get put on the ground if you don't Put me on the f***ing... Don't, you won't do it because I'll take you down with me, brother. Trust me. Because you guys don't hurt me. This isn't hurting. See, I am... We're not trying to hurt you, man. The police don't hurt people like that. Don't they? Kill me. They, I'm not gonna... Get you, weapon. you guys won't. What the weapon? It's okay. We're gonna get you the help you need at the main jail, man. Throw me down. Throw me in the ground. Come on. You won't. Come on, let's kill you. Oh, they got me up in there. Let's go to the car together. Let's go to the car together. Let's go to the car together. Do you understand, ma'am? All right, come on, I'll shut up, I'll shut up, I'll shut up. I'll shut up, I'll shut up. Okay, you understand that you are under arrest. If you continue to resist, you are going to keep incurring charges. Do you understand, ma'am? Yes or no? Go grab the car. I'll switch positions with you. Can I see your side, ma'am? No, I can't. That's fine. She's good where she's at. No, not yet, ma'am. You're in the recovery okay. position, okay? That's fine. I should have stayed in the pool. You should have probably left, is what you no, should have done. Oh, and then you came back, and then you, came back, and then you back, committed. This is my fifth time. I just want my fucking money. Then you need to take this him. To, you need to take him to court, ma'am. No, it's too late. We're past that, ma'am. Okay You're going to jail it's now. Okay that we're past it. You're gonna go to jail now. That's okay. Because I gave you plenty of warnings. I can't even feel my fing hands at this point. Okay, we're gonna fix that, okay? And we'll get you medically cleared if we need to, ma'am. I'll f go to jail for anybody. Anyone in my fing family. So I'll kill myself while I'm in there. Yeah, pull your knees to your chest. Okay? Yep, that's your chest. Now sit up. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Eventually, it started becoming clear to her that actions had consequences. All right, man, we're going to seatbelt you in. If you decide to unbuckle yourself at any time, that's like your prerogative, ma'am, okay? No, it's jail. Well, it's, it's, we'll save your life if there's an accident that uh, you may be involved in. Yeah, they all save your life, ma'am. There's a con pro to everything. There is. The way you look at it. There's a cause and effect to... Yes. There's, a, there's consequences to actions. There's yeah, causes you're and you're asking by father yeah you're sure yeah you're fucking right okay ma'am and it's not the first time However, for some reason, the fact that she was going to jail didn't quite sit well with her. As a result, she decided not to hold back her awful nature anymore. Mouth and actually showing your sh I didn't pull my gun on the walk. I literally didn't pull I my gun on the You guys all the time in the back seat of the cop car. You just are so you got the girl here today because I'm her too. I make her come more than her little daddy or her little lesbian. You're a, you're a trip. And you know what? Go talk to Very Christian Marino. That big ass mouth. You're good. You're good, ma'am. Are you? I'm not good. You're not good. I'm, good. I'm doing just fine. I know I'm doing just fine. I don't need a fucking daddy to coach me on how to. I'm, I'm not uh, being a coach. Shit. What the fuck? Because now you can't go nowhere. Turn the fucking music up so we can actually have a great time on this fucking way. No, I actually, so I, I really enjoy, I really enjoy you spatting from the mouth right now. I know the up men are. Literally. Literally how f***ed up you guys are on the right side of the law or on the bad side of the law. I get f***ed by both. Okay, ma'am. And I'll make you come more than your f***ing wife and I'll f*** your daughter while I'm at it. You f***ing little pig. Wow, that's uh, your that potentially is pedophilia, ma'am. It's because it's funny. Because it is that, at this point. That's potentially you know another crime that you would go to jail I for. I can't even hear you, to be honest. That's fine. I'm, I'm just I'm just telling Listen, you that's I'm possibly ready. another crime. Wrap it up, ho. Wrap it up. I got nowhere to be because I'm not working right now. No, we get That's paid fine. still. I'm a retired woman. Maybe not anymore, but I chose this life. You did, yes. Yes, I did. At you least you what? finally are right about something, ma'am. Because you know what? I don't know. So, it's like a test right now, literally. This is a big life test. I hope, I hope that you learn a big lesson from yeah, this. Yeah, I know. On how deep bullshit runs. And how segregated families are just because one makes more money and they're sober and they're happy and they're not mentally ill and they're not up. Sorry, I didn't choose this. 
I didn't choose to fucking be here. I'm so sorry. I didn't choose to fucking be here. And this is the shit that they give me. And they wanted me. I didn't so we're not going to take our handcuffs right away. We're, they uh, wanted me. We're, I'm going to get the first aid kit. And I'm going to clean it up and put a band aid on it, okay? I never chose to fucking be here. In the end, she was charged with resisting an officer, not carrying a license, and improper parking.